Hey guys, Proto here. Welcome back to Farming Valley. Here we are for episode number nine. Where in our hand, our hot little hand, we have our next building, which is a fishing hut and also the cafe. So let's um, grab our bike before we go too far, and we'll go and see where we can put these guys down. Um, the cafe, I know I wanted like just over here somewhere. Um, I don't know if I want it. Mm. Like in here somewhere, I don't want it to be too close to the other building, but I don't want it to be like a mile and a half out of town either. So let's go like that and let's have a bit of a look around. Room out the back, not really. Probably could come forward a little bit. Some water just there, which I guess we don't really want to affect too much. Um, uh, yeah, cafe was cancelled. Let's go cross maybe there so not too bad we've got a path there we can bring the path straight across uh, around this way it's all up on the one level we've got the pond there still which we can do something else with let's um get rid of that egg now the fishing hut this is going to be a little bit more difficult i think because i don't know exactly where i want it to go it looks like we've got a bit of water running down the hill here so I wanted it sort of over like here, but it's quite a fair way away from town, isn't it? I don't know, like it's, it's really flat there, which is good. I think there's some terracotta over there too. We can come back and have a look at. Um, we've got some zombies underneath us. Let's have a look on the other side of the bridge. We'll look like over this side. I don't want it too far away. Um, so that's there. Um, Goddess Pond, got like another little bit of water there. Guess we could probably put it down here. I think this might be a, a decent spot. We just come through and actually get rid of um, all this. Uh, get rid of that. rid of this. Uh, we've got a shovel on us. Yeah, we'll get rid of these as well. We'll just have a look and see how much room we've actually got because I'd like to make like a dock out the front. Uh, get rid of that. I think... Now where's the front door? Go like that. The front door's around this side, isn't it? No? Around this side. Nope. Yeah, yeah, there, there it is. Okay, so we put it there. It's actually on this other side, so we need to go this way. We come back. Let's go there and have a look, because I think I'd like to put in like a fishing dock sort of thing at the front here, potentially. But we really don't have that much room as far as water goes, which is really not good either. Like we'd have to dig all this out to actually have a decent area to fish. Um, let's go. Yep, in the water so we can just destroy our bike. I don't think I can pick it up. Damn it. Um, can I go like this? I want to go this way. Now it's starting to die. Don't die. Oh, too late. Oh well, it's gone. See, so over here, there's a decent amount of water there, which probably isn't too bad. So if we go like somewhere in here, maybe... Let's go like that and have a look. You probably want it down... Down the next level, so if we take these guys out. Um, go like that. How far back? We're going to have to go back another two blocks at least. Yep, let's go like that. Okay, so that many blocks. We're going to have to take all that out. Take this sand out so we can fill this in just here. I want to try and get these built and then I also want to look at um, Possibly trying to work out where our farms are going to go after this. 
Right, so let's throw sand in here. Alright, let's go like that. Got enough, we should have enough. There we go. Then we'll have to take it back all the way to here. And then we should just maybe just adjust the terrain a little bit behind as well, I think. Come back through and do like a custom terrain in behind. But as long as we get the majority of this out, we should be alright. And then once it's obviously built, we'll come back and look at um, like a proper dock and access. I think if we put in like a little, a real little bridge over here or something. Um, how much dirt do we have? We've got enough dirt. Let's fill this in. Oh, something like that. There we go. Um, Let's bring this out a little bit. There we go. So we put in like a little mini bridge over here or something. We'll see our town hall is going to go here. We come down and build like a little bridge, fishing hut, the dock out the front, another road coming down there. I think that'll be pretty good. Um, all right, let's get rid of that egg. He's got a good arm on him, this fella. Um, how's the cafe going? That's going to take a fair while, I think. I still haven't found another cow, but I really haven't um, been looking... To be honest, I need to cut the rest of this tree down to get this one as well. There we go. I think I did attempt to cut it down, but I ran out of ran out of um, durability in our axe, so that didn't help. All right, we've got that there as well. Let's come into here. Uh, that that and a side. I don't know if I can. We've got plenty of gravel. So I think I want to throw some gravel. I've been I've been opening them actually. I've been finding some weird things in there. Um, let's go and sleep quickly. I want to use some gravel on the ground as well. I think we're going to need to use gravel just to change things up a little bit and just add to the extra texture that's on the ground at the moment. I'm going to need to go and buy another bike as well. Uh, okay, let's harvest these guys. So we want to look at, obviously, where our farm's going to go. What other buildings do we want to build? I think I want to build at least a proper house for us. Um, we have just what we're staying in at the moment, which obviously isn't a house at all. So we want to build our own house. Um, our farming area, uh, a windmill, a water mill again, which we could probably take advantage of that, um, that over there, the way that water's running down. The mountain, hopefully. Um, we'll have a look and see if we can actually take advantage of that. Uh, is there any more that we've missed? Nope, alright, let's go inside. Throw these into there. Uh, where's our... there it is, our watering can. So we've actually got the copper can back, so now we should do 2 by 2 Just going to make it a little bit quicker, but not much quicker. can actually go, actually it's three wide, it makes it even better. Oh, still got to be careful we don't miss any because now that we're sort of all over the place with how our crops actually are, should make it easier though not to miss any, but then again, who knows. Alright, it doesn't want to eat any of that. How about that? No. Yep, let's have some blueberries. Alright, so we've got some gravel on us. I think they're all done. He's still over there building on that. Uh, let's look at some of this ground. So, so if I throw in, like, you know, some gravel and stuff, I still want to leave some grass in the road, but if we can throw down you know, the odd bit of gravel here and there, probably won't hurt. Just to sort of add that extra little texture. Right, there we go. Obviously we want to head this way as well, so we'll just, just come through and just throw in random bits of gravel. We've got a, maybe one coarse dirt on us or something, so... 
All right, there we go. All right, there we go. Uh, Thursday. Oh, you're outside. Are you the dude with the stuff? Yes, you are. Give me another bike. Um, let's get rid of this dude. Rid of him, get some more experience. We still need to go up another level. Still need to go caving down in here as well, actually. Um, still just waiting for him to finish that build and then you'll head over down there. So we can't really do too much down there at the moment. Certainly want to make, as I said, a dock. Somewhere for us to actually stand and fish. I know we can actually make like a fishing hole sort of thing. Um, which is one of our next builds, but the moment I certainly don't want to. Whoops, don't want to do that. Can't put one there, one there. Ah, uh, that'll do. Right, so if we grab this into our offhand, go for a bit of a caving experience down here because we've got to. We can close that off. We've got to come down here so we can get ready to close this off. Right, there's absolutely nothing down there. Uh, there's just a creeper down here. Thought I heard another one then. Right, swords leveled up to level three, and that's all that's down here. Just a creeper. Well, that's um, that's awesome. Really worth the uh, adventure that. Thought I was going to put you guys through. Alright, let's try and fill this in as much as we can. That and that, we can come back and fill the rest in, but obviously it's an absolute waste of time. I think the same is down here. It's like a waste of time as well. There's nothing there, there's nothing through here. Pretty sure this is completely empty, or does it go up the other side? No, completely empty. I think that was where we took the coal out of back down there. Yeah, yeah, I'm pretty sure that's where we got the coal from, so. Let's need to fill these all in. There's plenty of torches in there, so we shouldn't have anything spawning under there anymore, hopefully. Um, I'm not sure about the front here. I think I need to run some dirt and just some random stuff along the front. Maybe some flowers and some bushes and stuff like that. Um, we can go down Mining Hill. As well, I think that's one thing we could probably do. Um, right, throw this away. What else do we have? We've got some more gravel. We can throw that away. Um, our lead and stuff, I think I can throw some of that stuff away as well. Not throw it away, but put it in storage. But I've got a chest over near the mining hill, so we might actually go down in there and see what we can find. Uh, all right, let's get our bike instead of running. Uh, let's actually go in here like this. Come into here. Let's grab like three of those. All right, so we should be able to stay down here pretty much overnight, I think. So what I want to do is go. All that can go into there. That. All that. Uh, we can keep our food on us like that. Not going to worry about selling those. Grab our hammer. We want to grab our escape rope. It's definitely something that we need. Um, that can go. We don't really need our water bucket. But let's grab two stacks of torches. Well, we don't need that many, but um, I think we right click, don't we? We'll just run into it. Can't remember. Oh, there we go. All right. So we want to take these guys out. Best way is to jump and hit, but well, it is sometimes hard to actually do it. These other rocks just give you junk ore, which we don't really need, so. I always like to make sure I put a torch at our way up and our way back down. Make sure that we're video settings, brightness is as high as it can go. I try not to use too many torches down here. Right, no copper at all on this side. We've actually got nine which isn't too bad. We'll probably get like a, a whole stack. That would be pretty good. I don't think we need two more than just a whole stack. 
Right, there we go. Oh, nothing special. Where's our... There it is. Rough and ready. I don't even know what we can actually use that junk ore for, to be honest, so we might actually have a look. We're actually... We shouldn't be running either, should we? Alright, let's have some food. It's not going to matter too much now, but eventually when we head down, there's going to be chickens and stuff that are going to actually hurt us, and they're quite nasty. Alright, there we go. Torch there, head down. Throw another one. So I'm still running, aren't I? Alright, there's nothing here at all. Not finding a great deal of copper at the moment. Uh, see you later. I don't know what that means. Right, is that copper? No, there's no copper over there. Our exit way is over here, so we'll throw that down there. We'll start to hear chickens eventually, and we'll know we're getting down to their level. There's really not too much we can do at the moment until we upgrade our, our um, hammer here. If we upgrade it to... A, I think it's a silver one after this, a copper and then silver. So we need to actually have a copper, copper hammer to actually harvest the silver. So there we go. There's the chicken noise. And we actually didn't bring our sword. That's not a very smart idea, is it? There you go. That that kills them. I'll just use this. Seems to kill them all right. But still, no copper. Come on. But they are the worst thing to actually hit. The hammer actually does a decent amount of damage, which is good. But we're really <laughs> not getting much copper at all. Oh, there's our next level down. I'll just go down. I'm not going to worry about. Oh. God, actually, some of them are actually quite tough. Ooh, little bugger. Oh, there's some more copper. Another two, actually. Oop. That one. Make sure we get our experience. Not that it's a, a great deal, but oops. This is why I bring like a few stacks of torches because you can actually go through a fair amount down here. Let's go into here and go uses. No, no uses at all. So pretty much anything we do with it is actually. Um, I think we can sell it, but it's really not worth much at all. Now oh, that can go there. Don't really need... No, I've only got 25. We're not getting as much as I would like, but... Um, and also, even when you put down um, these torches, it doesn't stop the chickens from actually spawning, so... Don't spam torches everywhere. Just spam them enough so you can actually see. It doesn't actually affect spawning of the chickens at all. I guess it probably just helps you see the chickens a bit better. Where are we? Why 151? So we've got to, got to get all the way down to zero to get down to the, the silver level. Um, then once we go into the silver, we've got to go down to zero again to get down to the next level. Which is then... Hey! Which is then gold. Is our next... Oh, there it is. We run straight past it. The torch there and get that one back. Whenever I get like a double one, I usually just go straight down. Oh, 
Right, nothing exciting on this level either. You can hear chickens, but they might be down the next level. Or hiding around the corner like they always do. What's that? No, I thought there was one over there then. Right, we've got a decent amount. We might just do... God. Certainly need a better sword, I think. Um, let's have, a, have some berries. Alright, we'll go down one more level and see what happens. Hopefully we can find some more copper down here, but... Ah, it doesn't look like it. What level are we at? Only at 8%, so every time we hit one of these and get more of this, we're damaging it, but we're sort of going up. So we really we should be harvesting everything, but I can actually use this to harvest in a normal mine as well. So I can use it to harvest cobblestone. I don't know about like coal and iron and stuff, but just normal cobblestone you can actually use this. So um, let me grab a quick screenshot. Might grab a couple just in case. And let's if we grab our escape rope. Right click, that takes us straight back out, um, probably in a dangerous position, but let's get on our bike and get home. Try and get inside and sleep. Hopefully I will have watered the crops, I can't remember. I think we would have, but... Right, now let's go back out. Um, yep, our crops look pretty good today, so we must have watered them yesterday because they've grown again. So I'll come back over here and I'll actually try not to kill ourselves. Throw those back into there and we can grab out a sword, a pickaxe, that, that, an extra axe. Actually borrowed that gold pickaxe, well didn't really borrow it, we sort of took it, but anyway. Grab our sickle, our lead, let's throw those in there. Maybe I've got it in my hand. Yeah, that'll do. Um, grab that back. Actually, I want to take that with me. Hey, Brandon. Um, we'll head over here. Because that way I can just come into here and go that. Um, I want to actually grab that into my hand and go, here you go. I have a present. Uh, anything else I want to leave in here? Not really, I don't think. Right, so we need to harvest and rewater again. Right, let's go all the way down here. So it's much better once you actually get upgraded tools and stuff. Makes it much easier to water, but then also once you get the sprinklers, you don't have to water at all if you set it up right, so once that time comes, it's even better. Okay, we missed a spot there, there we go. Let's have another look through just to make sure we haven't missed anything else. Have a tomato while we're here. So we've got 5,000, so we've got a little bit of money, but not a great deal. Let's throw our junk ore in there as well. Um, go and check on the cafe. It looks like it's just about done. If it's not done, it's pretty bloody close. Um, I say, where'd all my levels go? But I think that happens sometimes when you come out from down there. Oh, I think he's still actually going. Can you get around that? Yeah, he is. Okay, has he put in the chest? He has... Cocoa beans, okay, uses, make some hardened clay, uh, whatever that is, brown hardened clay tiles, concrete powder, but I don't think I can actually, Cookie. I don't think I can actually plant those unfortunately, which sucks a little bit, but anyway, I will come upstairs and have a look, I don't know if there's another chest up here. Don't think there is. Uh, no. So 
So he's literally still building that. It's taken him forever. Right, so this is going to be our path over to there. Then we'll go from there. Back over to here. Go from there. We go across like that. There we go. Now, a little bridge down to there. We need to work out where our farming stuff's going to go. Because I like that staying there. So we can put another build in here somewhere. Um, as far as our farm goes, I don't want it all on the one level. I'd like to sort of change it up, but there's a decent flat area over here which we could probably use. I don't want it to be right near town, but I don't want it to be too far away either. I mean, like here is probably a decent spot. Doesn't look too bad at all. The backdrop of all the dead trees and stuff over there. Um, I think this will be good in this area. I'll actually leave that tree there too and just work around it, but I think that'll work. So we'll have a look at that. Um, maybe next episode or the episode after. Sort of not stressing too much about that yet. Um, I do want to do... Um, yeah, I do want to do like a a grape or like a vineyard, I guess you would call it, for these, which wouldn't be too bad. Just not sure. Maybe we can turn this area into the vineyard in the middle here, which wouldn't be too bad. So let's have a look. We've got some spruce fences. Um... Got a rough idea what I sort of wanted to do, but I wasn't 100% sure. Let's get some polished andesite. Just use something a little bit different. So a footpath might come over there. So if we go, say, here. That there. I think I want to use coarse dirt as well, like all along here. Okay, we don't have any more shovel. That's a pain. We've got coarse dirt. We should have... We've got a little bit. Alright, let's go in and make another shovel quickly. We've got some sticks. Let's grab two. We'll make two shovels just in case. That, there we go. I think... How far along can we go? That's three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 15, across, um, and then we'll go, is that right, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, uh, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, so that's technically 16. So if we take that out and that out, that there, um, just normal dirt can go back into there. But I'm not sure... How far over? Two, three, four. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. And then there. Four, one, two, three. That was only three. Okay, let's take that one out. I don't want them touching each other because it's going to be... It's going to be stupid looking, I think, if they're actually touching each other. Like the fences. Not in there. That must be in there. There we go. Uh, we'll grab these ones first. I don't need all of them, but I just want all these ones out of the way anyway. So hopefully it'll actually look like a, a vineyard. Right, so we come over, grab that out of there. Blueberry bush. So I was going to put them on top and then run it whole way along, like that, but then if I go like this, sort of, I don't know if it actually looks any good with it like that, let's take all that out, maybe if we do like every second one, like that, then will they join in together, uh, if we go leave a gap of two and go, oops, 
gap of two, go there, gap of two. Right, it'll go all the way across, so one, two, three. We don't really need to count it and just go the same as the other side. Like that, and go every second one. That, and then throw these on top again. Should just put off on it this way, make it a lot easier. Uh, two more. Uh, those crops can stay for now, but they will eventually go. Right, get rid of these. Then we'll go and quickly check on the cafe, which probably should just about be done now. I know the fishing fishing hut won't be, but the cafe should be done. Done it again. So we leave this as sort of like a vineyard. I don't think it'll look too bad. I guess we'll just wait and see what it looks like when it actually grows. Ah, because it will grow three high, so... I'm not sure... Still not sure on it. You guys let me know what you think. I think it doesn't look too bad, but... You never know, I guess. Uh, all that can stay. They can get rid of that. Don't really care about that at the moment. Let's quickly go and see if we can check on our... Cafe. Well, he's finished, and he, oh, he's done the fishing hut too. Good job, Yulof. Very good job. Right, so over here we'll have, is it Granny, yeah, Granny Caitlin. Um, Catlin, so she's open between five and four. I need $50,000 before I can get the thing off her that I want, which is going to take me a long, long while. Um, uh, I can work, I know how to cook. Um, she doesn't really help us at the moment, but obviously we need to buy some other things. Um, she pickled turnip recipe. So if we grab our book back out, kitchen counter, we just need turnips to make pickled turnip. And that's good. So I need to certainly make our own house now with like a proper kitchen and stuff, but that is quite expensive to, to get all that stuff that we need. Oh, and we got a knife. Don't forget the knife. Oops. Alright, so we're sort of slowly coming together. I just need to get the path done again. This path will obviously come around this way and like around here or something now to here. This one will probably change and just go up and around like that. Um, maybe even a path down the middle here somewhere, I think. Like maybe through the centre of the vineyard wouldn't be too bad. And that'll just give us a little bit less running around to do, I guess. But um, right here guys, we'll end the episode here. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you did, as always, smash that like button. Leave a comment, let me know what you think of the series so far. And if you want to see it continue, if you guys are new to the channel and haven't subscribed yet, guys, please do so. It's been pretty thanks for watching. See you again soon.